So hey everyone, welcome back to my new video. In this video I am going to show you, how to create this 2D animated scene in a light motion. And it's super easy to make this animation. So let's start the video. Download the project file from the description, which you will need for this animation. First we will make the background. For that click on plus icon, and add rectangle shape. Then click on this three dots. And select stretch to composition area, to make it full screen. Then extend this layer to 5 seconds. And change the background color to white. Now we will import the character. For that click on plus icon, go to media. And here select all the parts of the character, like this. Make sure you have the latest version of a light motion, otherwise you cannot select multiple layers. Also change default layer duration to 5 seconds. And click here to import all the images. After that we will arrange all these layers, according to the serial number given. Like this. Let's zoom in the preview, so that you can see everything clearly. Now we will animate the wheels of this bicycle. For that, select back wheel layer. Go to move and transform. Click on position icon to edit pivot point. And move the pivot point to the center of the wheel. Like this. Then we go to rotation, add keyframe at starting. Then go to ending, and add keyframe. And here change rotation value in clockwise direction. To rotate the wheel in forward direction. If you want more speed, then add more rotation. But here I have rotated minus 5 times. Now if we preview this, we will get this animation. In same way we also animate the front wheel. Select front wheel layer, go to move and transform. Click on position icon. And move the pivot point to the center of the wheel. Like this. Then go to rotation, add keyframe at starting. Go to ending, add keyframe. And keep the same rotation value, so that both the wheels rotate at same speed. Now we will animate the paddle of this bicycle. Select paddle layer, go to move and transform. Click on position icon, and move the pivot point to the join of the paddle. Then go to rotation, add keyframe at starting. Then go 15 frames forward, add keyframe, and change the rotation value to around minus 25 degree. After that go 15 frames forward, and add keyframe. Here change rotation value to 0. Then repeat the same process to loop this animation. Now if we preview this, we will get this animation. Now we will animate the front leg of this character. Select front leg layer, go to move and transform. Click on position, and move the pivot point to the joint. Then go to rotation, add keyframe at starting. After that go 15 frames forward, add keyframe. And here change the rotation to minus 10 degree. Then go 15 frames forward, add keyframe, and change rotation value to zero. So that we get an up and down animation. Then repeat the same process to make this animation loop. Now for the back leg we will do the same thing. First select the layer. Go to move and transform. And move the pivot point to the joint. Then go to rotation, add keyframe at starting. And here we will change rotation value to minus 10 degree. Then go 15 frames forward. Add keyframe, and change rotation value to 0. So that when front leg of the character come down, then back leg will go up. Now repeat the same process, to make this animation loop. In same way, we also animate the head of this character. Select the head layer, go to move and transform. Click on position, and move the pivot point to the joint between head and neck. Go to rotation, and in keyframe at starting. Then go to around 1 second, and add keyframe. And here change the rotation value to minus 20. Then go to around 2 seconds, add keyframe. And here change rotation value to 0. After that repeat the same process, to make this animation loop.
and we will get this animation. Let's zoom out the preview. Now click on plus icon, go to object, and add null object. Then we extend this null layer to 5 seconds. If you don't know about null object, then let me explain you. Null objects are transparent layers, which mainly used for layer parenting. Now we will parent all this layers of this character, to this null object. Select back leg layer. Then click on this parenting option above. And from here select the null layer. Then follow the same process, to parent all this layer to this null object. Now we will import the background image. Go to media. And select this image. Then change default layer duration to 5 seconds. And import the image. After that drag this layer down, and placed above white background layer. Now select this null layer, go to move and transform. Click on scale option. And decrease the character size to 28px. Then click on position option. And go few frames forward. And drag the character down, like this. And add keyframe. Then go to starting, and add keyframe. And move the character to left side out of the screen. Like this. After that go to ending, and add keyframe. And move the character to right side out of the screen. Then come back to middle keyframe, and delete it. Now let's add a simple camera animation, to our scene. Click on plus icon, go to object. And add camera. Then go to camera option, and here change the angle of view to 36.6 degree. To animate this camera, go to move and transform. And move the camera to left side, like this. And add keyframe. Then go to ending. Add keyframe, and move the camera to right side, like this. Now our animation is completed. And this is how it's going to look like, without camera view. Click on this icon, and select camera to enable camera view. And this is how it's going to look like, from camera view. I hope you like this simple cycling animation. Then don't forget to like this video, and leave a comment below. Also if you are new to my channel, then don't forget to subscribe my channel. And press the bell icon to get notified. I will see you in my next video, till then bye.